This video shows how to set up a fax connection with an HP printer. By properly setting up your fax connection, you can send and receive faxes from your fax-capable printer. Since each fax configuration is different, this video only shows a common fax setup, which includes a DSL modem and a telephone answering machine. First, unplug any telephone devices or networking equipment from the phone jack where you are connecting the printer. Plug a phone line splitter into the phone jack. Plug one end of a phone cord into one of the ports on the phone line splitter, and the other end of the cord to the line port on your DSL modem. Plug a DSL filter into the unused port on the splitter. Plug one end of another phone cord into the open port on the DSL filter, and the other end of the cord to the one line port on the rear of the printer. Plug one end of another phone cord, or the phone cord attached to the telephone answering machine, into the 2EXT port on the rear of the printer. If necessary, plug the other end of the cord into the telephone answering machine. If your telephone is separate from your telephone answering machine, plug another phone cord into the line out or telephone port on the telephone answering machine and plug the other end of the cord into the phone receiver. The fax connections are now set up for your printer. For optimal fax performance, you might need to adjust the following settings from your printer control panel. Lower the fax speed to prevent loss of fax data. Set rings to answer two rings higher than your telephone answering machine. Turn off error correction mode to help resolve connection issues and enable auto answer to automatically receive incoming faxes. You can find additional helpful videos at hp.com forward slash support videos and on our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash hp printer support.